let us go to our next topic the bod so for waste water as we already talked the three important things are solids how to determine the different solids we spent lot of time in the water treatment so i did not get into full discussion here so you should know how to estimate the different solids given the data you should know how to estimate the different types of solids so the second most important thing is measuring the bod because bod is a measure of the organic matter okay so before we talk about the oxygen demand why do we care about this oxygen demand to begin with right because dissolved oxygen is a very important aspect or very important or what what should i say it is necessary for the life of aquatic organisms and we need it too but we take it from the atmosphere but if you are an aquatic organism that live in the water it is important that that oxygen has dissolved oxygen in it excuse me that river has dissolved oxygen in it so rivers or any water can hold a certain amount of oxygen depending on the temperature so if you have your handbook in front of you let us see if you can go to i think you guys already went to that table didn't you water saturation table on page 34 guys didn't you go to the table already if not go there quickly we use this do when we solved the stream water quality problems right so you know at about 20 degree centigrade water can hold 9.08 mg per liter of dissolved oxygen and if the temperature increases that concentration keeps going down and if the temperature decreases going from 20 to 10 to 5 it keeps increasing okay so let us go with 20 degree centigrade so now if your river has this much oxygen and you dumped a big load of waste water in it what happens that waste water organic matter is now available as food for the microorganisms so the microorganisms use the food in the presence of oxygen and break it down to co2 and h2o which is a good thing however the problem is they need lot of oxygen in a short period of time and the river cannot provide that because there is a small amount of oxygen and that oxygen would be used up and thus the river become anoxic meaning anaerobic and causes serious problems so that is why you cannot dump lot of this waste water into the river but you can dump treated waste water with a little bit of bod which can be done by the which can be taken care by the river water okay so that is why we cannot dump waste water in a river so now how do i measure this bod bod is the biochemical oxygen demand or it is the amount of oxygen required to convert the organic matter into co2 and h2o by the microorganisms so you use the microorganisms to do the job and see how much oxygen they consume and that is the bod 